each person on the crew matters, just like just like each person in your unit matters, you know. Chris Palmarino is a veteran of the National Guard and brings the values he learned as a combat engineer to his current job. Honestly, I'm I'm just part of the team. You know, I'm, I'm but finding that team took time. When Chris returned home, he was unemployed for six months. And I just wanted to be grounded, you know what I mean? I, it, I think it frustrated me more that I couldn't, I couldn't just find a spot and, and stay there, you know? I like, I, I like being comfortable. Transitioning to civilian life wasn't easy for him, just like it's not easy for a lot of veterans, but finding work. I think that's what brought me back to, to neutral ground. He works for U.S. Pavement, a business that is sponsoring Pledge to Hire Veterans. CEO Mike Musto is asking companies that employ 50 or more people to hire at least one veteran next year. And there was a federal tax credit Musto used as a selling point. And the tax credits just make it a complete no-brainer for companies to hire them. And it's a great investment. The Work Opportunity Tax Credit awarded up to $9,600 to companies who hired an unemployed or disabled veteran, but it hasn't been renewed this year. This is the first time in six years that it hasn't been renewed. And the elected officials we spoke to showed little hope it would pass by the end of the year. This tax credit is given to filmmakers. You know, there should be tax credits that are given to companies that are hiring veterans. Because there are so many veterans out there like Palmarino who want to be part of a team again. For the Boston Herald, I'm Erica Mora.